Hello, my dear friend. This problem is asking us to figure out the area of the shaded triangle located inside a rectangle. You can pause this video to try this problem on your own, and at the end we will compare our answers. Before we start, please subscribe to my channel. This will help me to grow faster and you'll become a crucial part of that growth. To begin with, take a closer look at our figure. You see the two vertices of our triangle allergen with two vertices of a rectangle. It means that the triangle's area will be exactly half of the rectangle's area. So, if the area of the rectangle is calculated as 4 multiplied by 12, resulting in 48 square centimeters, then the area of our triangle would be half of 48, which equals 24 square centimeters. To demonstrate that the area of our triangle inside the rectangle is indeed half of the rectangle's area, I will divide our shaded triangle into segments and make them green. Then I will rotate each green segment by 180 degrees and position them to fill each corresponding white portion of the rectangle. Such a manipulation demonstrates that the green area is equivalent to the gray one. Therefore, the area of the gray triangle is exactly half of the rectangle's area. Please remember that all of this is only possible if two of the three corners of the triangle allergen with two corners of the rectangle, while the third point can be positioned anywhere between the other two vertices. Another way to solve this problem is to draw a line straight from the top of your triangle to the bottom. This line represents the height of our triangle, which is equivalent to the height of our rectangle, both measuring 4 cm. To find the area of any triangle, we multiply the base by the height and divide by 2. In our case, the base of the triangle is 12 and the height is 4, so we divide the product by 2. Therefore, 12 multiplied by 4 and divided by 2 equals 24 square centimeters. That's how it should be done. Feel free to drop your calculated value in the comments below. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.